Okay, so what do you do when you're fed up of the slow speeds of your Harley Davidson Sportster? Well, you borrow your daughter's 50cc scooter and see how you get on with that. Wow, this thing motors. So, no, I haven't gone crazy. I haven't had my license taken off me. What we're doing is we're going to give my little girl, I say little girl, she's my, my 20 year old daughter, um, a first try out on a scooter. We bought her a moped for her birthday. So what she's going to do is uh, have a little go at this in a little private car park area away from traffic and prying eyes and uh, hopefully <laughs> sorry this is really funny um, hopefully get a little bit of practice uh, before she goes and does her CBT in a couple of weeks time um, I suspect the uh, scooter is massively struggling with my weight which hopefully it won't struggle too much with a little girl on top of it Oh, downhill's okay. Um, this is fun. This is a, a WK TTR50. It's uh, almost brand new. God, cornering's weird. Um, and my, my feet are in completely the wrong position. But uh, it's okay. It's all working. I'm not really um, worried about the speed, but just worried about the fact that it feels totally different to what I'm used to. So it's a 50cc, it does 30 miles an hour um, and I think it's just something that she can get a little bit of experience on and it's a little bit of independence and I suspect in uh, six months time we'll be looking to get her a little 125 scooter or possibly even take her motorcycle test which would be immense and even better. Right, so we're going to have a little practice. I'm going to call it there because I, I, I mean, I might add a little bit more on the way home. But uh, it's just a bit of fun while she gets used to it. Oh my God, the steering's so weird. Well, I have to say that was superb. She did so well. First couple of manoeuvres in a private car park. She did so good. I think once she goes for a CBT and she's on the road, I'm confident she can do the job properly. Now, however, I have to negotiate a dual carriageway and a large roundabout, which I worry about when I'm on the VTR, let alone a 50cc scooter. But this thing's amazing. I mean, it's just so much fun. I actually see the appeal now of a scooter. I never have done before because I've never ridden one. But I do see the appeal. I'm just going to go because there's a gap. Head on the tank. Indicate over. Happy days. We did it. Oh dear, dear, dear. Yes, I get the appeal of a moped. Just jump on it and you just hit the button and you go and there's no drama there's no making sure you've got 150 mile an hour kit tested to withstand god knows what impact I kind of get I mean they don't go much faster than a push bike to be fair and it's just so easy to ride and and so much fun and actually the appeal of those guys that buy the, you know, the, the bigger 250 and 400cc scooters, the step-throughs like that, they, that's just, it's just easy. Look at it. <laughs> oh, this is brilliant fun. Well, look, I'm going to call it there because I'm having a bit too much fun and uh, I just need to carry on and concentrate because obviously I'm well aware that I am only doing 30 miles an hour at best. And now I've got a hill, so that'll probably drop quite a bit. Um, but stay safe, everyone. Take care of each other. Look after yourself if you're on a moped, and I will catch you on the flip side. <laughs> Wheelie! Oh, no, not quite.
Oh, I'm down hill now. Oh, Christ. Oh, I can feel the wind rushing through my beard. This is lush. <laughs> oh, I'm through the lights. Oh, this is great. Knee down. Job done. Happy days. Well done, me.